The book of life, the book of life. Sip the water from the book of life. Make a glass. And the money in them pot, but them a cook a spice. Use what you say I do. Should be true. Boo -boo -boo so we're going to talk about Aki today. Aki is on the menu on our Jamaican plate. And Aki is a delicious fruit. It's not a sweet fruit. It's a savory fruit. This tree behind me I planted from seed. It's five years old. And uh, we have ripe fruit on there. So we're going to restock our Aki supply for our food truck menu. There's the Aki fruit. Let's see how it's open. It's, it comes in this like bell-shaped pod. When the fruit's ripe, it opens up, and that is when it's edible. If it's closed, it can uh, cause serious sickness. And the fruit, the edible portion is this yellow part, which almost looks like a brain. They call it brain fruit. And uh, it's a buttery texture. It's not sweet tropical fruit, it's fatty, so it has a central fatty acids, it's high in vitamin E, tastes like scrambled eggs really so um, so it's a great breakfast item, it's the national dish of Jamaica and it's a breakfast food. Now that it's starting to open up we're gonna have to come back to this tree over the next few days and hopefully we don't get a large rain. If it rains while the fruit pods are open, it could spoil the fruit pretty easily. And that's always a pain. So you use a fruit picker to pick it. And if you happen to get one that's not open, just drop it. Leave it on the ground. When it, it, when it opens on the ground, it's still good to eat. So, but you don't want to mess with it. Um, sometimes they won't open up all the way, but as long as they cracked open, they're good. Alright. Last but not least. All right, that's a nice little picking. And it's a good thing too, because it was just about to rain, we got overcast. And uh, now we'll uh, take these into the uh, kitchen and show you how to, uh, how to peel them, because there's a specific way to clean the fruit and pack it for storage. And uh, see if it rains, it, this fuzzy pod even one rain it'll cause this whole thing to mold up and it's nasty so we just got these in time and if you come down to three sisters you'll uh, might be eating one of these okay so here's the aki it's got three pot it's got a three fruits inside sometimes there's only two sometimes there's a variety that has four All right, so to, to process the fruit we're going to remove them and that stuff right here is really part of the, the most poisonous part and there's still a little tail end that's inside there and the way I remove this is I just kind of take my nail on the seed and kind of remove that and then we kind of open it and take a look that looks good there's none of that string there Let's put that in here. Same thing. We're going to remove the seed. And we're going to take a look. That also looks clean. Okay, we're looking to make sure there's not a pink string that's attached to this stuff here. This stuff is, is poisonous. You eat if, if you leave that in there's more chance of getting sick so, you can see actually there there's some in the middle that's the stuff you want to get out you just want the yellow fruit so we're gonna 
it's a lot of times it stays attached to the seed but in this case we have to move remove that piece there and sometimes I just take my thumbnail and it comes right off like that and it's clean now these we put in a freezer bag and we'll fill up a bag I, I like the small bag so that it's like a nice portion when you're gonna go to cook it um, and this can stay in the freezer for a year uh, I like to use them within a few months um, the thing with Aki is you know um, the tree's gonna get harvested in succession because they don't all open at once so you just keep uh, you can have a start a bag in the freezer and you can keep adding to it as the tree ripens the pod and uh, it's a delicious fruit this is what we do to, uh, to make sure we can do the best Jamaican plate uh, the best Jamaican breakfast in South Florida better than Club Med uh, we're gonna give you the guarantee uh, we also got the green bananas straight from the field and the Callaloo we'll do another video on Callaloo and also show you how to prepare it and uh, we'll do a recipe also for Aki and saltfish. You can also, we also do Aki tofu for vegetarians, vegans and either way it's just a very delicious fruit you can get it in a can but if you live in South Florida uh, it's not something you're really going to find at farmers markets so it's a special ingredient you can find someone who grows it and maybe they'll uh, spare some we don't really sell it because we use it for our cooking purposes but it's a great tree to grow and um, grow your own food so if the world is my house why doesn't it feel like a home <laughs>